Mackenzie Thurkill Four Metro Diner with seven locations. There's one near you. The Davoli's continued tradition with great service and great food, like chicken pot pie, their famous meatloaf, and breakfast served all day. Metro Diner, where the locals eat. Now today we're talking about Trinity Christian who look to continue their success after winning back-to-back -back state titles. Now last year's team has won for the record books with cornerback Kevin Tolliver, Kendrick Norton, and Jeffrey Holland. Now even though players like that are irreplaceable, there are a few starters returning this year such as quarterback Billy Cobb and Jalen Bowie at running back as well as Rashid Martin. Now on the offense, after naming those three players, there will be a bunch of new faces on the offensive line such as Matt Ahern who is a transfer from Atlantic Coast. Now going back, Jalen Bowie, you didn't, he didn't get much playing time last year due to an ACL tear but had a stellar year as a sophomore so expect to see big things out of him this season. He is currently committed to Auburn but as well as looking at USF. Now on the defense, their secondary is one of the best in Jacksonville if not the best and it's definitely the best component of this team. The secondary will be led by Tyreek Johnson who is a sophomore and is everything everyone says he is and that's words straight out of coach Verlin Dormany's mouth. He will be accompanied though by linebacker Dominic Ross who is committed to UNC as well as Sean Wade who is committed to Ohio State. Now they do start their season off on August 28th against Trinity Catholic who is a team out of Ocala but they also will have other out of area teams such as West Orange out of Miami, Lincoln and Godby who are both out of Tallahassee. Now when I talked to Coach Dormany about this team, I asked him what's the comparison between last year and this year and he says you know last year's team they all started together coming up as freshmen and they all graduated together. A lot of guys on this team have been on a championship winning team but they haven't seen the playing time. So it will be a little bit more of a struggle but at the end of the day they're a Trinity Christian and we expect nothing but greatness. Reporting for 1010XL, I'm Mackenzie Thurkill.